Thank you, Bryce. Well, President Obama and House Speaker John Boehner came out swinging today. In fact, they went at each other with clubs, but it was all in good sport. The two leaders faced off in what some call a golf summit. The friendly game took place while a serious debate is also being played out in Washington. ABC's Tom Bradley has more. At the Andrews Base Golf Course in Maryland, President Obama and House Speaker John Boehner putted away their differences. Here, Speaker Boehner sinks a short putt. That's President Obama missing from about 12 feet. From about 15 feet, Vice President Biden drains one. Though their love of golf may have brought them together for a day, the president and speaker could not be further apart on important issues. Boehner told ABC's George Stephanopoulos back in April that despite those differences, he'd hit the links with the president. If the president invites me to play golf, it's the president. You don't say no to the president. Boehner may actually be poised to say no to the president on Libya. Congress has not authorized U.S. military operations there, and Speaker Boehner expressed concern Mr. Obama may be violating the War Powers Resolution by ordering military actions in Libya without congressional approval. There are also differences over budget cuts. Boehner is demanding deep cuts to reduce the deficit. Even though the two leaders linked up for the day, the White House warned not to expect any deals to come out of the Gulf summit. I think I can say with great confidence that uh, they will not wrap up the 18th hole and come out and say that we have a deal. And we're told President Obama and Speaker Boehner were partners teaming up to defeat Vice President Biden and the Ohio Governor John Kasich. After the match was over, the men went to the clubhouse to enjoy a cold drink and a little bit of the U.S. Open. Tamon Bradley, ABC News. The